Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron 4, Kaiserreich, playing as the German Empire last time. Well, we started getting attacked by the French, which we still need to bolster our lines up here. And we cracked the Finns, in which we're doing relatively okay for now. I know, ooh, there's quite a bit of lag in December, Christmas Day, 1940. What is going on? Good, help the attack, help the attack right there. You might help attack right there in the butts. Helsinki still needs to be taken. We might got to make sure that we can hold the line in, against the communards there. And my goal in this episode is to try to take Minsk. The road to Minsk. In which we are trying to take the capital. And capitulate White Ruthenia. And actually the Ukraine, while they did lose some territory, they've actually expanded down here a little bit too. Which is really, really good. Really quite good. And of course the communards are of course expanding into Spain. Which is of course not a good thing. But you know, whatever. It looks like we have a little deficit of some guys here. What are we missing? Manpower. Oh, we got one and a half million manpower. Current fighting strength. Oh, we need some more fuel. We desperately need more fuel. So we need a, just mostly a lot of manpower. That's really what we're missing here. Oh, and we sunk a few planes, convoys, escorts. Very nice. Pull out, my friends. Pull out. Pull out. Shippies. Uh, throw you right there, because you can. I'm not going to use you yet. You guys are repairing. Admiral, we only have 19 subs left. Please be safe. Please be very, very safe. <laughs> and, of course, the Russians invaded Sweden last time, but that's taken care of. Some guys right there. Ooh, you guys are probably repairing. What are you guys doing over here? Oh, yeah, I told you. Yeah, don't worry about it. You know what? I really don't want to do this, but pull you guys out of here. Just, there's no point to be in there. Here, escorting? We really shouldn't be escorting too much. Do that. Oh! Communard operative captured. Abdaling Dry. Awesome. Guillaume Le Pere. Ugh. We have a ways of making them talk. Good. Real good. Oh, and... Oh, yeah, we lost this up. Which we already knew what was going to happen there. Good. The Battle for Minsk is raging hard right now. Raging incredibly hard. Why don't you guys get down here and help out? Defeat those white Ruthenians. They abandon the Reich's Pact and they shall pay for it. And it is almost the new year. Almost. It's almost there. Support the attack. Defend there. That's good. What's going on here? Nothing. Nothing. Hold the line. We still have one tank division here, which is ideal. With that tank division. You might be able to break through, you might not be able to break through here. Probably not going to be able to break through. Ah, they can pierce us, so that doesn't make any sense. Actually, I mean, that makes a lot of sense. I just can't do anything there. That sucks. Good. Uh, they stopped attacking on our line for now. Fine, whatever. Minsk. As you can tell, the game is fairly laggy. Whatever. And we are building up refineries. We need more, more, more refineries. Building up more, fact more infrastructure. Do we need more factories on anything? We could use more tactical bombers. Let's see, fighters, yeah. Always make sure we have a line of military factories going on. Good, at least get one for now. Any more, more bombing, some Russian ships, good stuff. All right, all right. Austria canceled the lunnies, so be it, so be it. I'm gonna keep one guy there guarding, and that's good. You guys might be able to push this way as well. Him and Hoth, you look kind of menacing, but I kind of like it. I kind of like it. You guys help support the attack as well. Oh, we lost a couple planes. That's okay. We we're hurting their ships. Awesome. We sunk a couple more convoys. Good stuff. Good stuff. Agent. 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 Enemy turned. Another one. Russian. Oh, this is from Air Russia. Gennady Budyonny. I made that sound like he's Italian or something. Cool. Awesome. Nothing yet down there. That's okay. You can't win there. That's okay. That's okay. Hold. Your goal is to hold, eventually you want to... We should send our convoys that way. But Swedish state's looking real nice. And we captured another one! Gedene Bodioni has been caught again. Attempting to infiltrate our administration and leak secret information... What the... We just had you, though. Uh, what's going on? <laughs> no upgrade possible. Uh, encryption, decryption... Just go ahead and do some decryption, I suppose. That might help. I don't know. I mean, we can decrypt off faster, but that's okay. It's not really super necessary, but whatever. Good. We'll have Minsk. The road to Minsk. Uh, awesome. 
1941. It is 1941. Happy 1941, everyone. Hope you're having a great year. Let's get some more output and then we'll get more construction. And focus a little bit more on extraction as well. Good. We won down here. Great. As they're busy fighting over there, we might be able to smash our way here. Yes, good. Why well, is not very strong? They should have stayed with us. They had the option of staying with us, but they chose poorly. Very, very poorly. You know it's bad. You know when the Russians are doing bad when the Ukraine pushes in to Kuban. Mmm. Big mistake. Uh oh, what's going on here? Oh, it's like a convoy. That's all it was. Come on. Oh, actually, what's going on up here? You guys, well, that's not a smart idea. Please don't attack there. But you guys can definitely attack right here. Time to go on a little bit more. Emphasize attacks on core German Reich territory. Oh, that's a couple plans. That's okay. Minsk, come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, you're pretty injured there. That's fine. That's fine. We almost have it. We smashed just a little contingent of White Ruthenian Seal there. We have Expand Babelsberg for a little bit more stability. And we have Fuel Refining. Good. Research and Synthetics. That could be really good. Uh, right now, though. Grain and Steel. Not bad. Ooh, so. I need to choose one of these three things. Before we do that. Oh, what's going on here, actually? Nice. Prepare Collaboration Government. Great. Good job, guys. But for you guys, you are a linguist, you are a seducer, so I'm going to use you to come over here. And we need information on Russia. And you are, oh, network intel, oh, strength gain, I like that. Good, put them up here. I'm going to do as much as we can against Russia. Let's see, for a collaboration government, yes, please, commence when ready. Automatic repeat, seducer. And then resume your mission when you're done. Intel network, strength gain, uh, Marco. Good, 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 good. Ah, uh, yeah, I did want to double check this. So, oh, what would we have them? Weapon manufacturer, Mauser contracts. Mo plus 10% breakthrough for infantry equipment. It sounds really nice. This also seems nice, but I prefer breakthrough and soft attack. Defense is alright. Speed. Artillery. Well, we can get that if we want to anyways. More breakthrough force. Toad artillery. Hmm. Hmm. Capital ship stuff. Oh, add person of influence. Huh. We have no person of influence there. If that's a case. You know what? I'll probably just go with Mauser contracts. What is a corrupt steel one? Oh, is, oh do we not have corrupt steel for that one? Yeah, we need Mauser. Uh, I don't really feel like it, though. Artillery's so good, but we use... Oh, God. We're on grand battle plan. We're using our infantry quite a bit. We might as well get Mauser contracts. Might as well do that. We get a military factory. That'd be nice. We can't do get infrastructure, which we can build anyways. We can build factories. It really doesn't matter. So, Mauser Contracts. Founded under the auspices of the mighty Friedrich himself, Mauser has been instrumental in aiding the growth of German power over the past century. By sponsoring them more directly, we can increase and improve our small arms production. Also, a few comments from yesterday. Uh, one was that make sure that my audio settings are good. Sometimes there's been like cutouts or cut-ins or something like that. Or my audio just comes out. Cut cuts out completely, which doesn't make any sense. Minsk is ours. We have it. Right. So, let me know if there's audio cutouts and stuff like that, because that's not cool about if my audio cuts out and you can't hear me, or I'm trying to say something and you still can't hear me. And they invaded Cornwall, but they don't have Plymouth. Oh. Oh, fellas. Oh, fellas. And another comment. I forget exactly what it was. Oh, well. Whatever. I'll remember it soon enough. Infantry offensives? Good. More breakthrough. More organization. Let us grab recovery rate and organization for tanks. Oh, I do want to make tanks, though. They stopped attacking us here for now, which is fine. Whatever. I'm really not focused on this front, obviously. Uh, what are we researching? I need I need fuel. I got to get fuel first. That's the most important thing. And anything that could help my infantry is probably good to get as well. Are you attacking there? They have two divisions. This is probably a bad idea. Keep one guy here to help attack or help hold. I really don't trust... That you guys could do really well. But I'm going to do it anyways. Can we do a general attack in the area that we are currently at? We might be able to pull it off. What is going on with Russia? Why are they not doing great? I mean, then again, I don't play Kaiserreich a ton. But, so, yeah. Hold on, what are the losses? So, we have lost almost a million. Of course, a lot of that was from the French attacks. And before I took over... Uh, ooh, they're almost about to capitulate. Took over uh, from the AI. Russia's lost a quarter million. That's not bad for them. That's pretty good for them. 
Go ahead and stop attacking when you're done. Oh, the PSA is gone. That's not ideal. I would much prefer that they were still alive. Oh, boy. Pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out. Good. Oh, and Iceland is a battlefield. Union of Iceland versus the Ice... What the? What the? The Union of Iceland, so the Radical Socialist versus someone else right there. West End... Oh, the West... Oh, West, the West Indies is invading Iceland. What the heck? This is a weird timeline. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep going, keep going, keep going. We're doing well down here. Let the Ukrainians... They're trying their best down here. They probably can't crack them as well as we can. And it seems like they have more defense down here for the Russians than we do against White Ruthenia. We'll see what happens. At the very least, push them out of our land. Push them out. And there goes the Socialist Republic of Paraguay. Good. Another Socialist gone is a good thing for us. All right. Everything else is looking pretty darn decent. I love it. Now, where the this is the big boy division. Can I throw anything else on here? Do we need our... I don't have artillery on these big boys already. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What is our supply of artillery like? Oh, we dropped by 700. All right, so I don't want, I can't expand too much more here. That's fine. Let you guys get out, get out, get out. Good. We're doing okay-ish for now. And we've capitulated White Ruthenia. Move, move, move. Kill off any guys in the center here. Oh, they don't even... Oh, my goodness. We could maybe push very well. I'm just going to let this keep going on for now. That'd be great. My goal is to get heavy tanks, probably. Um, I think that's still a worthy goal to get. Look at that. Do not let them buddy up with each other. Do not help them out, help them out. I know attacking over river is such a bad idea, but that's okay. We lost another sub. That's not good. All right. Attacking here is just not worth it anymore. Engage in combat. Western approaches. Select all. Repair disengage. So, for the subs, your goal is probably actually up here. There you go. That's probably more worth it. Look at that. I love green. Three divisions. Destroy them, destroy them, destroy them. Move in, everyone. Move in. Model, you're doing a great job. I'm really proud of you right now. We still need more fuel. <laughs> Make more military factories. We got quite a bit of... Uh, Chromium from South African Federation. That's awesome. Awesome, 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 awesome. Oh, please move in. Please move in there. Gomel. Still doing okay-ish. What's going on? What's going on? Sunk four more. Good. I have to retreat my navy, unfortunately, but that's okay. We have capitulated White Ruthenia. That's so good. Well, it should be pretty good. Do that. Can I get some more from Belgium? Thank you, Belgium. The Belgians come to save some days. Apparently we're extracting or getting a base daily gain of 5.6 thousand. Wow. The Navy takes just so much fuel. Oh, no, no. You want to come down here. You want to do this. A machine assisted encryption. encryption. That'd be good so they can't crack our stuff. Uh, maybe I should have used my cipher. I'm going to wait till next time, though. Because what... Let's prepare ourselves first. And I, I don't even have it ready yet, so... Come on. You guys can probably stop attacking. Move, 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 move. You guys can hold... Uh, Gomel. These guys, I want to cut them off so badly. Attack from there. Good, good, good. Some more divisions for the other front. Just in case they want to attack us. And any other divisions will send to the eastern front. Good. We're doing pretty well here. Pause it, let the game catch it up with itself. Losses. Eh, not too many losses just yet, just yet. We need this tile so badly. Throwing more divisions. They're they're gonna crack soon. Gonna crack. Oh, at least I hope they'll crack. What is the intel that we have on Moscow? Oh, what is that? Gold? Increase uh, investment. Alright, whatever. Still a lot of manpower. Still quite a fewer divisions than we know of before. I thought yesterday they said 155. That's definitely not as many. More soft attack is always good. Always welcome. Nice. Russian subs. Or Russian convoys. Good, good, good. Let them try to escape. Let them try. They ain't going to go anywhere, though. No, no, no. Oh, look at that. That finished sub is gone. Good. Glorious. 
Any more? Oh, oh, oh boy. We found some navy there. Just in case, let's reactivate the Ludendorff Leinam. The Syndicalist menace looms darker than ever in fear of going into the next war unprepared. The reactivation of the old Ludendorff Line on our western border is considered vital. When it's once one of the dictator's many costly prestige projects, the line of bunkers and fortifications has fallen into disuse in recent years. This is nothing that cannot be solved with a bit of engineering ingenuity. That's a lot of guys. That is a lot of guys. If that is the case, get your booty out. Find that fleet, help them out, smash the Russian fleet. Come on, carriers, you got this. Lead the charge. We're taking a couple hits. We lost the screen so far. They're trying to retreat. Trying to retreat. Do not let them retreat. Sink them. Sink their butts as they're trying to leave. Come on, get more than just a couple screens. No. Oh. Oh, we got one. We got one. Can we make it two? Can we make it two? We made it two. Amazing. Beautiful. Now go back and repair. Or, oh well, they got some subs. Yeah, go ahead and repair. Not bad, pretty good. I'm glad I pulled out my fleet at that point. That was good, that was really, really good. And they're still attacking on the line, that was good. Oh, uh, well, I guess it's, who's that? Um, oh, America. Union of Socialist American States. Why is it Mexico? Oh, they joined the Entente. I wondered, I didn't think that they'd be fighting each other yet. Cheyenne is the capital of the PSA, that is, that sounds a little cursed, not gonna lie. That sounds a little terrible. Let's see. Um, you guys could probably expand that way, maybe, if you really wanted to. And still do okay. I'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, you might win. Good. How's the line? Oh, we did it. We did it. We made it in the circuit, boys. Telly ho into the Russian lands. Actually, what Ruthenian lands? Whatever. Keep them there. Keep them there. Nice. Two more Russian dis screens are gone. Good. We're doing well. I'm feeling pretty good about this. Get Grabbing more intel across the entire line. Great, great, great. Finish those guys off and then kind of hang out. And let's let's get our guys a little bit more planning because, you know, we're doing grand battle plan, which I almost never use. But, uh... Oh, look. Ausstung Divisions. Ausstung. Or, what was it? Something like that. Ausstungs. Festungs. Commandos. Oh, they cracked us. Good. Good. We're doing well. We're doing very well. Get the planning bonus. I'm not going to attack until we get more planning bonus, which is really good. Anything like this over here? Very nice, very nice, very nice. Shot on some planes. Okay, good, 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 good. Doing well, doing well. Yo, do we need more guns? No, we're doing okay. We need more tactical bombers, though. Oh, I was going to use up my tactical bombers until they're all gone. That's right. Do we have any more planes, actually? That's a good idea. Do we have any more planes? Uh, some close air support. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Keep you guys there, I suppose. It really doesn't matter too much. Uh, it's only four divisions, but, you know, it's four divisions that we can say we destroyed. So that's awesome. Ukraine, please stop attacking. Please, please, please. Those are boys you're talking about. Destroy them, destroy them, destroy them, and I might redeploy the line. I mean, the Ukrainians can hold the south, it seems like, for now. And if we can concentrate our forces in the north, we can take Petrograd. Probably pretty easily, actually. Oh, we can't win there, that's fine. Just let time go on. Build ourselves up. Try to get a little bit more steel. Machine-assisted encryption, very good. Machine-assisted decryption is next. Do you have any upgrades yet? Oh, Ludwig, for your stuff. You only 16 subs. I should make more subs. Subby boys. Oh my god, there's so much here. There's so much crud here, I don't even want to know about it. Um, sure. Improved sub hole. Level. Oh my gosh. I mean, I guess you can make that. These are really not great subs, but whatever. Come to Oldenburg or whatever. Or right there, that's fine. Cool. Alright, so they were kicked out. The Communards Arts kicked out. The French Republicans, that's fine. Good. Now, we are preparing another attack. Um, please don't leave holes in the line. That's not very good. That's really not good. Anyone have upgrades? No. Oh, we're getting navally invaded in the Mariana region. 
Oh, oh yeah, we're with Japan. I forgot about that. Oh, look at that. Guangzhou federal government. The ancient government. All right. All right, whatever. Oh, we lost a cell. We sunk to enemy stuff, but, you know, whatever. What else is new? Intelligence-wise. Pause on that. Just make sure we get this quick, quickly. As quick as possible, please. Bismarck C. Guys, Japan. I don't really care. I really don't care, Japan. We got a land war we're literally dealing with right now. Uh... I don't mind, like, attacking someplace, if we can get this someplace better for now. Hold, you guys do that. Look at my church words. What do we got for this? Civilian, 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 civilian. That's pretty good to do. Good. Oh, actually, what is our resistance? Who's doing resistance stuff? Infantry divisions? Actually, but make you go high. Yeah, that's actually probably important. <laughs> so we got this resistance. If I use militia, that makes it go lower, huh? Now I can't use robots because this is not old world blues armor. Light tanks would probably be okay, but I need to get some armored cars. Actually, what am I doing? I need cavalry. Yeah, let's change this with cap. What? Just what the heck? What the heck? Huh? Uh, mobile stuff. Thank you. We got plenty of army XP. I don't really care. Good. Do something like that. There you go. That's going to be who, who does resistance stuff. I actually could save us on manpower maybe a little bit. Yeah, no. I'll s oh, actually you're doing this. Ausluns Festungs Commando Divisions. This is for ports. Yeah, we don't want that on there. Oh, actually, do we, we don't have military police, so... At least I don't think we do. Yeah, why would you do that? Big boys, you can't choose this template because it contains special forces of battalions? That sounds discriminatory. If I want mountaineers to do that, they should do that. Hmm. Whatever. <laughs> Big boys looking pretty... Pretty thick. I love the thickness. Love it. Good. You're doing great. Now, I really want to hit the Russians as hard as possible. I'm going to change some of these templates to the big boy divisions over here. How much artillery do we have? We got plenty of artillery. Change all these guys, except, well, you guys already have some big boys. Do we have logistic companies? No, we need logistic companies. Do I have logistic companies? I have no idea. No, what am I doing? Hey, I, why do you hurt me like this? Reactivate the line. Good, that'll help defend us. Valuni and Luxembourg. Solidify that. Over the mouse and far away. Uh, let's do... And I do know we. I want to do the golf gamble, but whatever. I, I can't do that now. Um, synthetic stuff. In cooperation with members of Kaiser Wilhelm Society, the IG Farben researchers have already been able to make astounding breakthroughs on the area of synthetic production. By giving them access to more funds, we might be able to make their research ready for mass implementation. Very good. Yes, 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 yes. We're good on war support. Police crackdown. Get more weekly stability, which might not be bad. Create an African Africa section. Huh. Free trade. It's okay for now. Let's get a little bit less from Sweden. Thank you. Limited exports. That might be worth doing, but we can wait. Um, Mauser. That's what I wanted to do the entire time. Change you guys to big boys. Good. Make you stronger. That didn't hit us too hard. I'm going to do this at several different sections of the, of the line, just because I don't want supply to get too bad. Some big boys. It's good. Hurting ourselves up, up here a little bit more, but that's okay. Oh, look, they actually took Cornwall. Good. Great job, guys. Great job, Entente members. Good job. How much longer do we have to wait for? Oh, that takes too long. No, I'm going to have to advance earlier than that. If that's the case, how about you six? Big boys. Forty combat with big boys. I love it. Now, we're probably not going to do that anymore, just because we got to keep a little bit in reserve. Let's see. Convoys, great. Ludendorff, or not Ludendorff. Ludendorff is gone, I think. Go and repair for now. You don't have a lot of guys with you. Level 5, that's pretty good. Alright. They're busy in the south. They're weak in the north. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Belgium, Russian Empire, civilian oversight, that's fine. 
Compliance is 3. Point oh, there goes the crane. 3.9. Why do you hate me so much? You're the one to declare war on me, boy. What are you talking about? If you don't like being conquered, they don't conquer me. All right, it's time to go, boys. Let's see what we can do. Push in the north while the Ukrainians are trying to stage a false flag attack on the south. And it's not even a false flag. It's just they're t trying to... Oh, my God. Some of you guys are extremely weak. Oh, my goodness. The, the south might collapse if I don't do anything. If I don't push hard enough in the north. Hmm. Machine-assisted encryption. Decryption, it is. Push in the north. Push, push, push. We can do it. We can take Petrograd in this push. I know we can. Are, they, are we getting attacked? Oh my god, what's going on right over here? That did not look good. I come over here and I was like, oh my goodness. Get the ships in there. We, What what happened there? Not bad. Okay, whatever. We lost an allied convoy. Whatever. Let time go on. So we get more improved fuel processing. We currently get 5.9 thousand pieces of fuel a day. Uh, Von Bayern has been injured. Look at that. Facial hair. Oh man, I wish I could grow something like that. It's awesome. Well, it looks a little scraggly, but whatever. Cool. Improved oil processing. Great. More fuel. Screw production efficiency caps. I need fuel. We get 6,000 a day. Not bad. It's a little better than what it was earlier. Can I grab any more by oh, anybody? Bulgaria. Yes, Bulgaria. We should establish our old ties. You and me. Good. A little bit more steel. We're, going, we're pushing well in the north. Ukraine, just please stop attacking. Please. Oh, what's going on over here? Nothing. Not really. Oh, they invaded there. Good. Good. How many ships are in repair? A good amount of ships are. Keel. We could improve them so we can get bigger stuff. So, what's going on? Build another military factory. And build more refineries. Yeah, right there. Palatinate. Good. More fuel, more rubber, more awesome. Oh, they sunk some of our planes. Oh, we sunk some of their... Oh, we sunk some of their subs. Good, yes. Yes, very good. Death stacking still works. It seems it's always work in uh, Paradox games. Death stacking does. Which is good. Oh, we're doing well. We're doing well. We're pushing pretty darn hard around here, actually. We're going to get Petrograd, hopefully. Oh, naval invasion in eastern Micronesia. Japan, I hope you like what you're doing, because once the Russians are beat, I'm going to whoop some Japanese booty. Well, actually, not really. Hey, we've got Petrograd. The blow to the Russian morale will be severe, because I really am not interested in Asian wars. Um, like I said at the beginning of this campaign, I'm just interested in the European affairs, for the most part, for this campaign, of course. So. Oh, Petrograd's over here. I thought it was over here. Like, Oh. Yeah, go ahead and take that stuff. That'd be good. Push as hard as you can in the north. The south is going to need it. Hey, look, an encirclement. Love it. Kill them off. Don't have to deal with them later. Getting invaded in the Bronx Sea. What? Oh, wait. Bronx Sea. Uh, he's almost a sea wolf. Even though he is an old guard, he is doing the best he can. He is doing the best that he can. Which is what I ask of all of my generals, and you, as you as well. Everyone, let's do the best we possibly can. Good, move in. Oh my goodness, the north is doing well. The central line here. Look, Vit Vitebsk is doing alright. You guys just help out. Come on, push him in, push him in. Sometimes I really don't understand why the AI does what it does. Because it doesn't make any sense, but then again, I remember it's the AI. So, whatever. Couple planes, go bye-bye. Come on, come in our friends who wanted to go to war with me. Come on, try to take some more Belgium. Try it. Eight militia divisions. That's not a lot. That's not very strong. Light tanks are looking pretty good. Hmm. What if... Wait. Hold on. Come on, stop lagging. Motorization. Infiltration. What if I made these 40 combat with light tanks? Has anyone tried that before? I'm sure someone has. Nice. Nice. That's really cool. Good. Keep it up. Keep it up. Machine assisted decryption. Encryption is next. 
We are struggling in some areas. That's okay. That's okay. A good struggle is always needed sometimes. Take the city if you can. That'd be awesome. And we've moved up farther north. We've lost over a million guys, but casualties honestly aren't that bad. We've killed off 400,000 more Russians. Wow. So we lost a plane. That's okay. How's Communard France doing? Or, you know, Communard France. Ooh. They're anarchists. Nestor Makhno. Oh, Ukrainian anarchist. Oh, uh, at least we're at war with you so we can dispose of you when we're done. We have a lot of divisions still. They got a lot of militias. A lot of militia divisions. It would be really bad if the Netherlands joined the Third International right now. Come on, come on. Disperse Industry 4, great. Grab more extraction, we need it. And I know I said I want tanks, but I just can't afford doing tanks when you got extraction stuff going on and other stuff going on. The attack, while not successful everywhere, is doing well where I place it overall. If the rest of my divisions would like follow suit and actually attack when everyone else is, we would do, be doing better. Nice, convoy sunk. Guys, there's literally no point to guard <laughs> up there. There's, it's a lake, guys. It's, it's a big lake. It's a pretty big lake. But it's still a lake. Fuel. I just... Fuel, fuel, fuel. Because there's no point to have tanks if you can't, you know, refuel yourselves. Or having a fuel, period. Oh, good. More divisions, great. Throwing... Since they're not really attacking us too much over here, throw you two Russians. Good. And now, the Russians, they ha haven't cracked yet. They haven't cracked. Like the Ru like the Finns did. We're making one big Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth. Good. Help them out, help them out. Uh, yeah, you guys, come up there as well. Smash them. Help them out. The French von Bayern, you might be back. If you have enough forces pushing that way, you might just win. Good, we push them back out again. Good. Keep an eye on our stockpile. I cannot afford a deficit of anything. I'm really surprised. I mean, I guess the Communist France, the reason why they're not attacking me yet is because they're really focused down here, which is not good for us. But in the short term, uh, we're doing pretty well. Unser Kampf, the movie. Our struggle... Following the widespread popularity of the best-selling series produced by Prolips, Prolipian, film director Wunderkind Lini Riefenstahl resolved to turn the material into a movie based on the accounts given. Unser Kampf boasts the highest production values hitherto seen, made possible by state investments into the Babosberg Studios, and offers a frighteningly real depiction of the war, starring Heinz Rumen, Hans Abers, and Theodor or Theodor Luss. The story focuses on the heroism and dedication of the small people in the Weltkrieg, such as the valiant Corporal Adolf Hitler, who sacrificed everything for his or Kaiser and his Reich. A stellar movie! Ah! That Hitler guy. Hmm. Never heard of him. Be interesting to learn more about him, but then, last again, that is merely a movie and a book and is not real life. Oh, oh, schnickies. You leave that area. You did a good job, but when th those guys start showing up, you just kind of go bye bye. Cool. Great. Uh, another national focus is done. Von Braun? Uh, it's 1942 soon, so let's get artillery research. An area in which the German army has a long-standing tradition of lagging behind is an area of light support artillery. While the successes in building huge, unwieldy, and impractical prestige objects such as the Paris gun can't be doubted. It's time to invest in some more practical and more efficient alternatives. My goodness, I can't believe we're already 34 minutes into this video. You know, when you're having fun, time just goes flying by. That's fine for now. Get some more from the Swedish state. Good. This is why I need more extraction stuff. Oh my goodness. Just pull out. Prepare. Just pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out. Alright, so how much fuel do we get a day? 6.8 thousand. I mean, our guys are doing better on fuel. Ooh, we probably need more manpower soon too. But it's still not enough. It's still not enough fuel. I'm glad I'm doing more extraction stuff and advanced oil processing and fuel refining four, which is going to be very, very handy. Uh, if this is the case right here, you can probably tell you or to stop. Repair. The attacks? Honestly, they're going okay now. Um, they could probably use more planning bonus. Go ahead and stop when you're done here. 
If anything, you guys can probably... You guys can honestly probably still attack this way and do well. Maybe not. Kingdom of Spain is gone. The fall of Gibraltar. The mighty rock has fallen. Um, go... Yeah, don't attack there for now. You guys... Ooh, you still might be able to win there. Because we got to reevaluate our line. Because we're doing really, really well in some areas. Really, really, really well. Ooh. That's not good. Sport equipment. Do we have enough to throw on? Logistics. No. Hmm. Hmm. Big boy's looking pretty good. I thought I was researching logistics. Eh, must have been in my mind. And the next attack we shall use... Um, that one thing. Yeah, that one thing. Good. Go all the way to there. We want more planning bonus. We gotta get more planning. Lots and lots of planning. Because let's see, you guys. You're doing okay. Some divisions are doing okay for planning. Some divisions are doing... Eh. We've lost... Not, not a huge amount. Definitely made them lose quite a bit more, which is good. Good, good, good. Everyone's going to stop. Plan. Think about what's going to happen. Think, think, think. 6.8 thousand fuel a day. Great. Good. Keep sinking their stuff. You're doing a great job, guys. Mm. Repair. Oh, wait. We got more sh ships. You're all busy. Don't go home. Oh, we got two. Oh, my gosh. We got another carrier, too. Oh. This is on task forces. That's a. That's really not good to throw in there with them. Hmm. Docked. I really want to throw you in there. I want to use these carriers, but we just don't have the fuel for it. Do strike force. That'll be okay to do strike force with that group. Good. We're doing okay. Just reform the line. Get a lot of strength. We need a little bit more manpower. Artillery. Let's do what we did earlier. Oh, maybe not. Some of these guys just don't have the infrastructure for it. You guys already big boys? Mm, kind of not. Some of you are. Some of you guys are not. That's okay. Let Russia spread out just a little bit more. And our intel on Russia, how's it going? They have initiative to commanders. Hmm. Iceland. Union of Iceland is gone. That's good. They have 89,000 manpower. What had happened? I mean, that's awesome for us. Don't get me wrong. That's awesome. I love it. More fuel. Fuel, fuel. You know what? Let's finish off that thing too. And fuel. We need German fuel autarky. Currently, six point nine thousand things of fuel. Come on, keep attacking me. Why are, the, why are the Americans attacking my line? That makes no sense. That's a big communard boy. The fall of Lisbon. Oh, Portugal has fallen. That is not good. Armored operations, which means this is going to open up very soon as well, which is very not good. All right, it's July 3rd, no, July 3rd 1941. Oh, supply consumption goes down. That's exactly what I want. Good. Please repair, 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 repair. Ludwig, are you a sea wolf yet? You are. Great. Soon he can become a silent hunter or a lancer. What is better? Do you guys know? <gasps> no, not, no, no, not, no, 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 no. Silent hunter or lancer? Let me know in the comments below. Which is better, do you think? Lancer, silent hunter. But our Kaiser has died of a pulmonary embolism in the Charité Hospital in Berlin today. It is the end of an age. Wilhelm II was the last European monarch who reigned during the 19th century, and his whole life he tried to uphold, sometimes succeeding, often failing, the values that he identified with that era. With his death, the 20th century will at last be fully upon us. All over Europe, flags are flying at half-mast, and public ceremonies are being organized to honor the Weltkriegskaiser, the Kaiser who won the war for Germany. One of the onlookers in Berlin is Kronprinz Friedrich Wilhelm, who will now have to uphold the honor of the Kaiserreich in the world. The Kaiser is dead. Long live Kaiser Wilhelm III. Oh, sh He looks really, like, um, nervous. Like, that. <laughs> I don't like that too much. And actually, we got more defense right now anyways, because we're on two fronts. That goes away in less than a year, which means we got to strike hard while the iron is hot. Fuel looks good. I'm going to even grab even more extraction right now. 
Oh, we lost another sub. That's not good. Double extraction. Right now. Ex excavation 3. Excavation 2. Oh, I call, I call it extraction. It's ex excavation. Close enough. You know, whatever. Close enough. How fast are you guys plan? Holy crap. Actually, when do we have our next thing? 33 days. Can I wait a month? Oh, I'm not waiting a month. Screw that. The Russian lines. They need to be smashed. Good. Now this is going to be great. We have a few more big boys with, uh, you know, more artillery, more stuff of that, which is great. But with the coronation of Wilhelm III, with the passing of the great uh, Velt Kriegs Kaiser Wilhelm der Dritte, Wilhelm der Dritte has given us grand speech on the coronation day to guide all of Germany towards prosperity and to safeguard our interests across the globe. Heil der im Sieger Kranz. Hmm. Very cool. Lost another sub to four more Russian convoys. They gave their all, and we shall do the same. Uh, tank designers, ship designers. Carriers, more deck size and range. Capital ship, armor. Deck size, a bigger deck size sounds good. Cruiser manufacturer, that's okay. Small ship manufacturer is okay. Cruiser manufacturer, make it more faster. Armor? It's really armor. And a little bit more speed. Deck size and range. Ooh, that's hard for me to tell. 20% deck size. You just put more planes in there and get more range for those guys. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Oh, crud. I should not have done that. I need more manpower. Or I will need more manpower soon-ish. Oh my gosh. What happened? We lost a sub? Oh no. Our allies or potential non-aggression packed people. Australian Confederation guide whoever. We lost... A screen. We sunk two light screens, two more screens, two fast battleships. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, and we're pushing. Oh, we're pushing. We might be pushing great in some areas, but we're pushing. Oh, man. This has been a great couple months for us. Definitely get that. That's awesome. Eberhard, what do you have? Good. Good. You're doing great. Oh, my goodness. The South, they're even, even with... Like, some of these guys are, like, half-strength divisions. They're still pushing. What has happened to Russia? I don't know. Is Russia really this weak in Kaiser right now? I just thought I don't understand. But you know what? I'm going to accept it. we got 7.1 thousand things of fuel done a day. From refineries, they give us 1.2 thousand. Base gain, 48. From fuel itself, 5.9 thousand. Not bad. Ah, and Indians are in a civil war. Ooh, we lost... Ah, eh, we didn't lose anything. We didn't lose anything of importance. Oh my god, we're just... Oh, every time I come back over here, it just looks so good. I just... Oh, I love it. Ugh. I know this is a long video, but I just... I don't want to stop when we're doing pretty darn well. Oh my goodness. Okay, we take their port. We might be able to. But we might not be able to. We might not. But we might be able to. Let time go on so I can research more things so we can keep pushing into the Russian Empire. How close are they to capitulating? Not that close, obviously. They've lost over a million. 24% of the way there. With more breakthrough for this infantry equipment and more soft attack and stuff like that, I mean, this is good. I'm feeling really good. 65,000 manpower? That's really sad for the Russian army. They're still only on limited conscription, too. They have up to a max of 129 divisions. Good. Pull out, pull out, pull out. Good. Good. You know, oh, what's going on over here? Did we lose anything? Uh, plane, that's okay. Nope, not much. We sunk, or we lost a destroyer in exchange for four more destroyers and a couple enemy planes. That ain't bad. Alright, who can give me my goods? That's okay. Fuel-wise, Bulgaria. Give me more. Ukraine, yes. Good. The more fuel, the better. Oh my goodness, we're approaching closer and closer to Moscow every single day. And it's only August, 1941. Uh oh, oh, don't tell me that's Bulgaria... Rubber? No? No, we're okay. We're doing okay. Just an amazing push. If you want to, you could cut those guys off. If you move fast enough. Six divisions, yeah. We should be able to cut these guys off soon enough. Artillery research. So, 
Support Conrad Zeus, or... I guess we get Border Region. Oh, the factories are nice. Let's do a European Exchange Program. The Europe Pot has provided sufficient returns to expand its overall control to include members of our research program, too. We get more research. But, unfortunately, we have... This video's gone up for quite a bit. So, as great as we're doing right now, or good enough, we must end it here. So, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we continue to expand East and hold the line against the Kaminards. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.